What is up guys, Jeremy here and welcome back to another video. Just wanted to show you guys a really cool application from the App Store uh, that I think that everybody should have, especially if they have multiple Apple devices like another iPhone or an iPad, Apple Pencil, even the Apple Watch. This is just really useful to have. So it is called Cloud Battery, as you guys can see right here. And if I launch it, it's basically gonna display every single device that I have linked to it and their battery state. And this is so useful, at least for me, it is incredibly useful uh, just because I do have multiple Apple devices and I can quickly go into this application and see where the battery life on all of these are. Uh, another thing that's really nice is my iPhone 10 is actually jailbroken with check rain. So if I let the, the 10 die, I have to basically re-jailbreak it on my Mac, which is super annoying. And since I've had this application, I've never let this iPhone 10 die, so I haven't had to go back into um, my Mac and open up CheckRain to re-jailbreak it. So I find this to be incredibly functional. There's a few different settings here. As you can see, there's privacy, there's reset. You can pay to remove the ads. I found the value in this app to do that. It's an app I think I'm always gonna have at this point. Um, you can restore, you can write a review, or you can share it, and then there's more information about the developer there. Now, if you guys are just gonna use it for free, you can do that, it's totally possible. It's a free application. You'll just have some advertisements to be expected so the uh, developer can at least make a little money off of such a cool application that is free. Uh, and that's all I wanted to show you guys. Um, basically, to enable different devices, you just download the application onto that device um, I believe there is a little bit of settings to configure for the Apple Watch and then the Apple Pencil is really simple. When you guys download this app, it'll walk you through a screen explaining how to display everything. Now, one thing that I'm actually kind of disappointed in and I, I haven't found a way to add my AirPods um, to Cloud Battery yet. So hopefully um, the developer adds a way to implement that so that I can see where those are for battery. Um, and that would be really useful. So uh, anyways, this is Cloud Battery. I'll leave the App Store link down in the description. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely throw me a thumbs up. That helps me out a lot here at the channel. And if you guys wanna see more videos like this in the future, don't forget to click that subscribe button. This has been Jeremy and I will catch you guys in the next one. Later.